Super Flower is a household name in the PSU world known for its top tier power supplies. But now they're branching out into the CPU cooling space with the Super Flower ST4 ARGB. A sleek four pipe air cooler with eye catching lighting and impressive specs on paper. But will it deliver? Let's find out. First up, the unboxing. The packaging is minimal yet professional. Inside the box, you'll find the ST4 heatsink, a 120 millimeter ARGB fan, and mounting hardware for both AMD and Intel platforms. My sample did not include the thermal paste, but the production version will. The cooler itself feels well built, featuring four heat pipes and a unique offset fin aluminum heat sink. The included 120 millimeter fan uses a hydro bearing, which should provide durability and quiet operation over time. Aesthetically, the ST4 has a premium look, which is a nice bonus given its affordable $35 price tag. To install, take out the mounting hardware for your CPU. There are different sets for AMD and Intel. I'm installing on an AM4 here. Place the standoffs in brackets, then fasten them in a star pattern. Then place the cooler onto the bracket and fasten it down. After installation, I ran some temperature and noise tests to see how the ST4 performs. At idle, temperatures hovered around 40 degrees Celsius with noise levels in the 30 to 35 decibel range. Under load in Cyberpunk 2077, the CPU stayed impressively cool, sitting in the mid 50s and never exceeding 60 degrees Celsius. The fan did spin up during gaming, which raised noise levels to about 40 to 45 decibels. While it was a bit louder, it was still far from being overly noisy. Overall, the ST4 is a solid entry into the air cooling market from Superflower. It combines high quality materials, excellent build quality, aesthetics, and value, making it a great option for a variety of builds. But is it worth $35? The Thermalrite Peerless Assassin, also priced at $35, is often considered the gold standard for value air coolers. It features a dual heat sink, six heat pipes, and two fans. While the Peerless Assassin offers more performance for the price, the ST4 feels more premium and has a sleek aesthetic that stands out. So if you're looking for solid value and performance, but also care about premium aesthetics, I definitely recommend the Superflower ST4 for your build. What do you think about Superflower's first foray into CPU cooling? Let me know in the comments. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more hardware reviews like this. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.